So where is this trade taking place? Our mutual friend will fill you in eventually. Right now, the less you know, the better. Where are we taking him then? You don't have to know that either. <laughs> Our mutual friend speaks very highly of you. Calls you a chameleon. One day, I'm cooking arroz con puerco for Castillo's Navy. Next, I'm shoveling horse shit for the fucking cavalry. I could never go undercover. I'm a terrible actor. <laughs> <laughs> Pretending to be one of these things now is easy. Not killing them, now, that is tough. Aren't we making a lot of noise by walking in the river? The water will hide our tracks if they send dogs. This way they can't follow us. Why you? Why me? What? Our new the less you know, the better. Oh. 
Repinga. I will. Oh, and Captain Diaz. Shut the fuck up. About time. Pinga, don't give me that. You had G-Man worried too. Oh, he's never stressed. Now what? Stay safe out there, mijo. We'll take El Capitan to a secondary safe house. Thanks for the backup, Danny. <laughs> What are you going to do with him? Sergio mentioned something about a trade. I don't want to spoil the... Surprise over the phone. Come by and see me. I'll tell you all about my hot plans in person. Gracias, honey. But why they kept so long? Oh, yeah. Two Another years is crazy. Because of me. They know I'm again. Please, talk to me. I stay strong. I don't know how much history you kids read, but our revolution was a bloodbath. Yara endured so many casualties and so many beautiful women were widowed, alone, yearning to feel something other than despair. I am responsible for countless victory children. I fathered them, but I was no father. Instead of doing the right thing, I ran into the arms of the next woman. For decades, hundreds of mothers wrote me. They sent pictures of my children. I denied my part. I hid in this mountain. One can hide for only so long. The guilt of being a bad papa pulls my heart into the ground. I am too ashamed to see them, and honestly, a little terrified of what they might do. That's why I have penned these letters. Just a couple to start. Can you please deliver them? I will send you pictures of my children, ones their mother sent me. You are a smart one. You can figure out where they live with a quick glance. Gracias, Danny. May the wind protect you on this journey to mend hearts. What was Yelena Morales thinking? That speech was basically a declaration of war. Anton will not take that lightly. 
What's up, Lorenzo? I got someone to help me send you photographs of the photographs of my children. To your telephone. We did it using this telephone. Got it. Thanks. Technology these days can do wondrous things. When I was your age, when you took a photograph, you would have to develop the negative and make a print. That would take a week. Imagine waiting a week to see a photograph today. I know. Gotta go. And your telephones? I don't know why they are called that. They are really hand computers. If one person had one of these back in 1967, they could control the world. Or destroy it. Imagine that. Mm-hmm, yeah. That shit's cray-cray. Look, I gotta go kill a jaguar. Danny, I bet 50 years from now, you will be able to kill a jaguar with your hand computers. I will never see that day. I will only have to imagine it. Ah, such is life. Good luck. What are you hiding at home, senor party planner? Hopefully something that goes boom. Looks like I should track these power lines to their source. Looks like I should track these power lines to their source. 